How are you doing? We are good. We are so excited. Yes. So, tell everybody where you're from and what brings you to Britain's Got Talent today. Okay. Um, we are from Uganda, Kampala, Africa. So we are going to dance for you guys and for you judges. Yes. Oh, thank you. And have you brought anyone with you? Mr. Kavma Dauda. Is he there? Yes. Can you say hi? Can we say hi? Yeah, go on, please do. Hi. Oh, welcome to the show. Thank you so much. Tell us a little bit about this group. I have 30 kids that I'm taking care of. Some are orphans. We are using music, dance and drama to make lives better. Amazing. Oh my God, it's amazing. Oh, bless you, darling. Oh, you. That's incredible. Ghetto Kids is like an orphanage in Uganda. We are 30 kids living in one house. We are one big family. Before, I was living on the streets of Kampala. Being part of the Ghetto Kids has given me a lot of opportunities. They feed me, they go to school, they buy me clothes. If this one is sad, we all be sad. If we are happy, we all be happy. <laughs> <laughs> Mr. Kavma Dauda, we call him dad. He's not our real father, but he's the one who takes care of all of us. Ghetto Kids is all about making their lives better through paying their school fees, feeding, hospital bills, all the basic needs that a child wants. My dream is to build a very big home and help many kids as I can. Over the hills and far away. It's a happy place because it's all about making lives better through dance. Because of him, that's why we go to school. That's why we are healthy. Because of him, that's why we are here. This is the first time for the kids to be in London and they are so excited. What do you think London's like? London, it's cold. <laughs> it's freezing. <laughs> I'll be so proud to watch all of them perform tonight. Because of dance, we are here. We can't wait. We are so happy. We are so excited. Take me to my happy place. Well, we're all rooting for you, and the yes. stage is yours. Thank you. Thank you so much. Oh, look, look. Oh. We are the ghetto kids from the Pearl of Africa, Uganda.
a place for a you and I A little space for a you and I That's never actually happened. <laughs> Normally, the golden buzzer is pressed afterwards. Oh, I'm sorry, I got it wrong. <laughs> yeah, someone didn't explain the rules of Britain's Got Talent to him. He gave you the golden buzzer and you performed with the confetti. It was magical. <laughs> and by the way, who's this little one? My name is Josephine. Hello, Josephine. How old are you, Josephine? Five years. I just want to say, you're absolute superstars, every single one of you. What you're doing is absolutely incredible, and we are honoured that you have come to Britain's Got Talent. You've lit up the stage, and yes. the energy in the room and joy is incredible. Thank you. Thank you so much. Your talent is unbelievable. And it felt to me like you'd really raised the bar on Britain's Got Talent, so well done. I was literally exploding, I'm telling you. You should be proud of yourself. I can't wait to see you back. That's yeah. all I can say. I think it's incredible that you're so young, you've flown all the way, and no fear, this is an audition we're going to remember. And it was brilliant. That's what this show is all about. Yeah. And that's what the Golden Buzz is for. At the time